Hey, what's up? What's up, Coververse? How you doing? Welcome to another video. So we got Queen Cobra here dry snitching on herself. Now I made a video a couple of days back. I think I posted originally on the 9th. It got taken down by someone I won't name yet. Okay, no, 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 no. I'll name her Jessica Mesca. Jessica Mesca took my video down. And I feel I'm gonna need to make some videos about that whole situation there. But for now, let's get into queen cobra because this is very tied into my video about the whole smuggling ring so uh, let's go like people think me having to get my room done is a joke no <laughs> if i don't get this dresser in my room before i see josh he's getting rid of it so then where's she gonna put all my clothes that are in there huh <laughs> fuck Who's getting rid of it? You mean you mean your mom? Your mom's gonna get rid of it? Because her daughter that is nearly 40 years old hasn't uh, taken the time to put away her things. So I seriously have to get this done. I wish I had like Adderall, I really do. So I could put a pep in my, and, and I'm telling you, every time I really need to do something and get stuff done, I get sick. <sighs> Whoa, did she just dry snitch on herself talking about Addy so casually? You know what? She actually has done this a lot in the past. And she will casually pop in that. I wish I had some Addies. I wish I had some Addies. Yes. I've noticed every time I need to get something done in my life. Especially on a time limit. I get sick like for instance me i mean me pulling my back that's not getting sick but you know that took me out for two days that was two days i could have got stuff done it's like and now you know i'm sick with this like sinus whatever <laughs> i'm like ah. i do wish i had someone to help me I don't even care how bad my room looks right now. I wish I had someone to help me. Wow. Because it doesn't help being like ADD and like all over the place and like not knowing where to start. You're literally cleaning your room and organizing your room and you haven't organized and cleaned your room for about a week now. How long does it take to organize your stuff? I mean, sometimes it can take a long time, but if you do it and you keep doing it, it's going to get done. <laughs> Oh my fuck. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna go get my... I know I look like trash right now, but I should probably get my alcohol first. Because once I start cleaning, I'm not gonna want to leave the house. <clears throat> hey, birdie. What kind of birdie are you? Where'd you go? Leave this. Hey. Where did the bird go? yeah alien that's exact uh, that's how i am and uh, it is really sad um but i can't it's like i've i can't do that anymore and so it's like i have to push myself even though i feel sick it's like i can't I can't not do it. So it's like, it fucking sucks that I'm sick right now. I mean, at least my back doesn't hurt. <sighs> I can deal with being like whatever kind of sickness this is because it's not that strong. Thank fucking God. <clears throat> but yeah, I, I know exactly what you mean. I just sit there because it's like... <sighs> okay, I get it. If she's sick, she's sick. I get that. But still, come on, how long does it really take to clean and organize a room? I have like really bad dandruff right now. That's why I don't want to go out and that's why I need a shower. It's like I don't want to go out in public looking like this. I'll have to wear my my go puff hat. And speaking of someone sent me a screenshot of of that nasty bitch that backstabbed me last year and if for people the burn baby burn stream i did the other night that was a note from her and an envelope i also have a a pill bottle too don't ask me i hope i still have it 
who the hell is she talking about? Because she's casually laying on that she also has a pill bottle too. So that means you got a, a note slash letter and a pill bottle, which I will assume if she's going to send a note and a pill bottle that there's going to be pills in it. And if you've already talked about Addie's, which kind of sparked this idea of a conversation to start rolling in your head. I'm going to assume that there were Addie's in the pill bottle that this person sent with the note. So who is she talking about? Is she talking about Luxie? I don't know where it is though, but I burned stuff from her the other night. Or was this somebody else? Now I gotta go look back at the stream and try and figure out who sent this to her. Because I made a video talking about the whole uh, smuggling situation and saying how, you know, uh, my sources tell me that she really didn't get anything. But that doesn't necessarily mean she hasn't been getting stuff from people that I just don't know about. And this is kind of confirming that now, isn't it? This bitch, I don't know if she literally went and got a GoPuff hat or if it's Photoshop. But she's trying to steal my look. This is how bad this insane bitch wants to be me. She either went out and got a GoPuff hat or had it Photoshopped onto her head and is wearing dark lipstick. Because she was feeling my look. What's she talking about? Bitch, I don't need you feeling nothing about me. I feel like you need to go into an institution. Like, stat. I'm gonna say that about you every time, girl. The therapy that you're wasting all that buku money on ain't working for you. So it was perfect timing, because I didn't know about her trying to copy my look. Whoa, 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 wait a second here. Who the hell is she talking about? Now I gotta look this up before I start. Oh boy, this is interesting. It says, Dearest Nall, I hope you enjoy these presents as much as I enjoyed getting them for you. Take it easy on yourself. You are loved, which is bullshit. I'm not saying I'm not loved, but coming from her, that's... Well, I don't have any sage. I don't have any sage right now, so. It's from Luxcon. You know what? I'm not even gonna bother. The whole point of this is that she is self snitching on herself without realizing it. The night I burned that, I didn't know that people were sending me screenshots of her because uh, I didn't check my Discord messages. I didn't know until the next day. I'm like, oh my fucking. I was like, I guess it was like perfect timing that I burned this stuff from her. I'm like, oh my god. Like, she's so unoriginal, she can't even get her own looks. She has to steal shit from me because she's some obsessed fucking weird bitch. Or if she has a go puff hat, and maybe she has more than one, she sent you one, and she has a second one, or the original one, or just the first one, and she just gave you her second one, so therefore she ain't really stealing your look. Who am I? No, I'm not, I'm not saying that she actually did this. I'm just, I'm just putting a little bit of logic here. Talking about Luxicon. So if you ever see anyone named Luxy with like a heart emoji, um, and not, I'm not talking about like the heart. I'm talking about like, you know, the heart inside of us emoji. If you ever see anyone in any chat rooms named Luxy, stay far the fuck away from that bitch. She will ruin you. She will fucking ruin you. And that's actually like a lie okay what happened was there was a love triangle happening where one guy was playing two women one of them was luxy the other one was Nell. and actually that's that's really not true he was playing several women one was luxy one was now there are others which i you will not name now but stay tuned for my part two on the xanthony series because i guess since she's bringing this up i guess i gotta make another video she is a fucking 
sucky bussy bitch although she can't even get no dick hard to get into her sucky bussy because her pussy is pocked marked up ugly as fuck and if a dick gets near it it will wilt like a fucking rose bitch that's actually not true Anthony was uh, pretty rock solid hard when uh, he was laying with her just saying just saying pedals drop <laughs> pedals drop oh you don't need to hear about her you see her in any chat rooms um she likes hanging out in auntie jesse's chat now because i guess she needs a place to belong because she'll never belong anywhere uh if you ever see her anywhere stay far the fuck away do not engage do not engage she is a wild animal do not engage wow all this over a guy huh no, I just wanted to bring it up because the bitch is like literally mentally ill. She's so mentally ill that she has to try to copy my look. And sh I'm like, yikes. Yeah, you don't need therapy. You just need a lobotomy, please. I mean, you're already halfway brain dead. So can, can we get the full lobotomy going, please? All right, people, I'm gonna wrap this up here. If you want to, uh, I don't know, listen, watch more of this find it on queen Corbis channel all i gotta say is i will bring you the part two of the xanthony series to tie a few loose ends together and see you then take care cobraverse